All right, we are back. We uh, it is pre-release weekend, and uh, before I get to my pre-release kit, which is what I'm going to open for you guys, we have a new patron, and uh, we're going to do a quick opening for our new patron. Um, our new patron is MTG Cards and Review. You should check out uh, his uh, his his YouTube channel. Um, I, actually, I'll put that in my description, so you should you should be able to find it there. Uh, any time. But um, because I'm planning on putting the new set in next month's opening for the patrons, um, I'm not going to refill all of my packs uh, for this uh, this one opening. So instead what I'm going to do is I have uh, four remaining packs uh, from the November opening and I am going to roll this four-sided die to determine uh, which pack we are going to open for Mr. MTG Cards and Review. So, let's give it a roll. And we're just going to see one, two, three, four. And the number is four. So we will open this pack and put the other three aside. So good luck to you, sir. Uh, let's see what kind of pack we have for you. Right. We have got a Theros Beyond Death pack. Excellent. Let's open you something extra super mega spicy. That would be fun. All right. Going to give it a little double tap. We'll give it a little uh, rub and a little shake. It is the uh, only pack after all. So it's like last pack mag magic right from the beginning, right? All right. Here we go. Let's see what we can open for you for your first, uh, first patron pack. Thank you so much for becoming a patron. Uh, we really, really do appreciate it, um, and uh, and welcome to the fold. We uh, we really do appreciate you. Um, all right, so we've got. I, I, I guess it doesn't even matter that we go through the. Ooh, but you know what? I will send you Underworld Dreams because that is a great card. Uh, and then your other is Metamized Prophecy, and then we have a rare, Seb McKinnon rare, Allure of the Unknown. Beautiful art. Beautiful art on that card. And your land, I'll send you that as well because these are great. And uh, junk token. All right, so that is what we've got for you. So congrats, sir. I will send you your cards uh, ASAP. Thank you again very much for being a patron of ours. And um, yeah, let's move on to the uh, subject of the day. I'm trying to find I got some sleeves here, but they're all kind of crusty and old looking. Let's put this aside. Okay, so we have my pre-release kit uh, that I picked up today. Well, today's Friday. I'm recording this on Friday. Uh, this will be dropped on Sunday, though. Uh, so I got I got my pre-release kit and my two extra packs because I didn't do a uh, in-store um, uh, sealed uh, event. Um, I just took these home so I could open them with you. But we'll see what I get in the uh, kit itself. And uh, maybe get an idea of what I would have played if uh, if I can decide such a thing. All right. So let's see what we got here. I'm excited for this set, but I gotta admit I have not followed things very closely, so I don't know all the cards. I'll be really interested to look through these later. Um, ooh, that is sweet. That's some cool art, man. Holy cow. Very nice. All right, I think i put these down like so. All right, we've got a white, white die. You know what, everybody rolls and see what they get. I'm gonna say 16, because that's my lucky number. 14, not quite. Close, but no cigar. Uh, and then we've got this wedding invitation. Pretty sweet looking. I like it. And, uh, okay, yeah, that's there. All right, we got our six packs, so I'm gonna line these up. Three by three. And I'm gonna add these two a little over to the right. So I can get these a tap two, but I wanna open up just the kit first to see uh, what I would've played. And we'll give this a tap two. So we'll start with the kit. Start at the bottom and work our way to the top. I'm gonna do a little double tap. And 
that card as well. All right, here we go. I'm going to put that aside. And let's see what we can do here. And these two we'll, we'll put over to the side also. Um, well, actually, this will go on top because I want to see that part of the kit. All right, first pack. Here we go. All right. These appear to be, I think they usually are American made in the uh, pre-release kit, so uh, should be in the back there. All right, I'm going to skip all the commons, although that is some gorgeous art right there in the uh, showcase. Um, all right, we've got a Whispering Wizard. And we've got a, what, what in the world? You know what, there's like... I guess maybe that came off. There's like a line, like a roller mark or something, and straight down the middle, but it's kind of wiping right off. All right, Whispering Wizard, Markov Walter, and Mischievous Cat Geist. Under that, we've got a rare Doll House of Horrors. That is some cool art. I like that. And we got our land, a beautiful island. And we got our day night. What is that? Oh, and then the uh, helper card. Very nice. I'll actually make two piles up there for that. All right, next pack. Let's see if I can keep this video in a reasonable amount of uh, length of time here, considering that I'm doing two things. All right. Cut through the commons. Nope, oh, went too far. All right, we've got a magma pummeler, boarded window, that's terrifying, and child of the pack, whoops. And under that, we've got a rare, ascendant pack leader. We've got a wolf and we're looking at green now. Where did I put my rare? I'm an idiot, I'm not even paying attention here. Let's put the rares down here. You guys are gonna kill me in the comments, aren't you? I don't know what's happening. I'm just, I'm all over the place today. That's nuts. Sorry about that. All right, there we go. Another island. We got a zombie token. And a helper card. Next pack. This time I'll get it right. We're putting stuff away, I promise. Thing two is uh, decided not to join me again today. He, uh, he actually has a sore throat, so uh, we hope he feels better. But uh, in the meantime, I'll just go ahead and open this on my own. Got a reclusive taxidermist, a storm chaser drake, innocent traveler. Whoop, don't want to move too many cards here. Under that, we've got a rare blood vial purveyor. That seems like a pretty decent card. Um, I just don't know much about it. And we got a foil, uncommon. Well, wait, that's two cards down. Oh, it's below the land. I see. There's the planes. We got a vile spawn spider, foil, uncommon. And then we've got our, here, I'll put that up there. We've got what, a junk token and the helper card. So, right now, maybe, maybe we go in Golgari. I don't know. We'll see what happens. We'll see what the rest of the packs bring. But so far, we're out of black and a green. See if any of those double up. Screaming Swarm. Another green. Got Retrieve. And another green. We've got an Oak Shade Stalker. There's a lot of noise going on behind me. I apologize for that. Thing three is making noise. We got another rare. Red. Creepy Puppeteer. Huh. I really don't know what color I'd be playing yet. I don't have a clue. That's nuts. Forest and a spirit token. And a helper card. Okay, two more packs. And I'm... I'm really tossed on what I'd play. I don't know. I'd have to really look at the cards and kind of dig through the, uh, the uncommons to get a better idea if need be at this point. I don't know. Um... All right, we got a Blood Hypnotist. We've got a Dawnheart Geist. 
And we've got a Brian Comer flip card. We've got a rare. Welcoming Vampire White. We're going to hit every color here, aren't we? All right. We've got a land. We've got a Plains. And a Blood Token. And a Helper card. Last pack. Can we get something that's not blue so that we have an idea of which way to go? And a Mythic would be great, too. I'd be all right with a Mythic. Um... All right, Thirst for Discovery. I am seeing a lot of blue in the Uncommon, so that might lean me that way too. Uh, Fell Stinger. And Twin Blade Geist. I don't have a blue, so maybe this will be, no, this doesn't look like a 165 or 277. It is rare. Red, we've got a Kessig Wolf Rider. All right, I guess I'd play red then. Our wolf Token. Um, I don't know. I don't know what I'd play. Well, let's see what this card is. See if it gives us anything. More red. Curse of Hospitality. I guess I'd play red. I just don't know what else I'd play with that. Uh, there's no clear leader on all that. Um, yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know. So I wouldn't have won any cards, that's for sure. So these packs that I'm opening here, uh, my bonus packs are more than I would get if I played in the event because I don't know what I would do with the deck. And it would be a mess thrown together because I'm not good at sealed or draft. That's okay. So here's our first bonus pack. Let's see what we've got here. We've got, okay, all our commons. We've got an Ancient Lumber Knot. Rending Flame, Infestation Expert. That's interesting. And another rare, Storm Carved Coast. Uh, tap unless you control two or more other lands. Very nice, just like the, uh, yeah. All right, I'll do that. I think I've got a, I might have a foil here. Nope, 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 nope. I forgot about the second token again. All right, I'd love to get a Mythic. Just one Mythic would be great for this whole you know, opening here. Um, you know, it's not a necess uh, necessity, but it would really be nice. So let's see if we can do that in this pack. Evolving Wilds, great card. I'm glad it's back in this set. All right, we got a Valorous Stance. Cloaked Cadet. Radiant Grace. We got a Mythic. Thank you. I have gotten a Mythic. 50 out of 277, I'm guessing it's blue. We have a Cemetery Illuminator. Whenever Cemetery Illuminator enters the battlefield or attacks, exile a card from a graveyard. You may look at the top card of your library at any time. Once each turn, you may cast a spell from the top of your library if it shares a card type with a card exiled by with Cemetery Illuminator. Okay. Very cool. Um, very cool. Yeah. Well, I got my Mythic. I was asking for it, and I got it. Island, ooh, Foil Common, Militia Rallier, and what is this, another Junk Token? Oh, that's going to go in the Foils. Yep, another Junk Token. All right, that's where we're at, and uh, it's been fun. We will have um, a, uh, a box to open soon. Uh, that just needs to uh, come in for me. And, um, yeah, we will see you next time. So uh, stay safe out there, stay healthy, and support your local game store. Take care, everybody.